A Manitoba farmer who says $40,000 worth of canola was stolen from his farm fears this is only the beginning. CTV's Danton Unger has more on his concerns. Grain thefts are about to become a common occurrence as costs for fuel and fertilizer rise. It's already happening and it's going to happen more. Les Wetterburn is warning fellow farmers to be on guard. The canola went missing in the night is what it looks like. So uh, the people that did it uh, scouted it out and came and uh, did the job. Wetterburn recently discovered at some point in the winter, thieves went into his grain bins and made off with fifteen to 1,600 bushels of canola worth about $40,000. Makes you feel a little sick and uh, think that you go to a lot of work for nothing and somebody can just drive into your yard and take something and uh, and then I hope they get away with it. And I, I really, really hope that that doesn't happen. The Rivers Police Service says the theft at the farm near Rivers is being investigated. But given the fact the theft happened sometime between December and early March, the trail has gone cold. Neighborhood inquiries have been made by police, but no evidence has been gleaned from this. Given the absence of witnesses, CCTV systems, forensic evidence and or witnesses, this matter is quite challenging, the Rivers Police Service told CTV News. It's not the only recent report of grain theft. RCMP says in early March, a farmer in the RM of Argyle reported 2,000 bushels of wheat had been stolen from a grain bin the previous summer. I believe there's going to be lots more. Wetterburn fears these thefts may become more common given this year's rising cost of fuel to run the farm equipment and fertilizer, which he says has doubled in the last year. That's on top of the high prices of grain, which makes farms a target. It's a concern shared by Manitoba Crop Alliance Chair Robert Misko. As supplies are harder to get and times are getting tougher, everyone seems to have more and unique ways of trying to get things that they shouldn't have. Misko says Manitoba Crop Alliance is trying to spread the message to farmers to beef up security. You have to increase the vigilance, uh, locking bins. I know everyone thinks that locks are only as valuable as a person that doesn't want to cut them, but I guess any any means of, of uh, extra security is probably well worth it these times. To protect his yields, Wetterburn says he's now installed cameras on his farm and will be using anti-theft products in his grain from now on. I just think farmers don't realize how vulnerable they are to this, and I, and I said we'd be the first to admit that we didn't know we were that vulnerable until it happens. Danton Unger, CTV News, Winnipeg. Rivers Police Service is asking anyone who witnesses suspicious activity to call their local police service or Manitoba Crime Stoppers at 1-800-222-8477.